guys now this looks just like real baby banana food i didn't know this but amazon sells very realistic food like very realistic like chicken hi guys welcome back to reborn love and welcome if you're new to my channel my name is Fabiola and on this channel I make lots of reborn doll videos so if you enjoy reborns make sure to subscribe to my channel today I am going to share with you guys how I make my food for my reborn toddlers and reborn babies all right guys so the first thing you are going to need is some containers Right here I have some empty baby food jars, I have banana, spinach, I have this little carrot food baby jar here, but don't worry if you don't have little baby jars, you can always buy these little containers at Walmart, or you can get these little containers at the Dollar Tree. For your reborn toddlers, I definitely recommend these little containers, I got them at Walmart from the craft aisle. We are going to start out by making baby carrot food. I am going to be sharing a secret with you guys how you can make your baby food look even more realistic. You need to mix hair gel and lotion about equal parts. Have you guys ever seen like the Yoplait yogurt or those yogurts that have like little chunks of fruit in it? Mixing hair gel and lotion will give you the same exact result. So try doing equal parts gel and equal parts lotion. I am going to be using acrylic paint for this, but if you do not have acrylic paint, don't worry, you can use regular food coloring. Okay, I am going to mix this up. Okay guys, so here I have my carrot food. Just let it sit for a few hours and then you'll see what I'm talking about. Okay guys, next up we are going to be making green beans. I'm going to show you what it looks like just with hair gel and food coloring. It looks pretty amazing too. For this I'm going to be using food coloring. Okay, so this little jar says spinach and zucchini and peas, which to me looks like green beans anyway, but this is what it looks like. But it definitely looks pretty realistic to me. So there's one option, just plain clear hair gel and green food coloring. You can even add a little more lotion if you want it to look a little more creamy but for me i think this looks pretty realistic i really like it so now we are going to make baby banana food all right so i'm going to start by adding some lotion and a little bit of hair gel i don't know why i got this really tiny container of hair gel I am using yellow acrylic paint, but if you don't have acrylic paint, food coloring works just as well. So this so far looks like banana pudding. Hey guys, now this looks just like real baby banana food. If you ever go to the grocery aisle, you can check it out and it really looks like this exact same color. So yeah, that looks very realistic. I'm really happy with the result. And it looks exactly like this. This is the color, it is sun -kissed Peach. That turned out pretty good. You can also print out really cute labels for your containers. 
All you have to do is go to Google and type in baby food labels and you'll find so many cute little labels that you can print and put on your little containers. Next, we are going to make some reborn toddler meals. So lately, I have been very inspired by Amazon. I didn't know this, but Amazon sells very realistic food. Like, very realistic. Like, chicken, sandwiches, donuts. It's all fake, and it's pretty awesome. If you guys want me to review some of those fake foods, please give this video a like or just let me know in the comments. I am going to be showing you guys how to make a very realistic chicken soup in my next uh, video where I show you how to make more foods. But today I am going to show you how to make macaroni and cheese. So all you need is pasta. Next, you are going to need some Play-Doh. I know this sounds crazy guys, but just trust me, this looks very realistic. It doesn't spoil. And the Play-Doh won't dry up if you just keep your lid on your container, it's still pretty tight. So yeah, it's a great option. So all you do is put little pieces of Play-Doh in there. And then we are going to mix it all up. And like I said, it's really nice because it's not watery or anything. You don't have to worry about getting your Reborn doll messy or anything. It looks super cute and fun. The perfect little toddler meal. Play-Doh is a great option for Reborns and it's not messy and it's fun. You can make like peas and carrots and store them in like this little containers. Very realistic. It'll look like actual baby food and it's really fun. So definitely give it a try. In a new series where I show you how to make very realistic food out of clay and just different things like that. And I'm also going to be reviewing some fake foods that look very realistic. So if you guys are interested in seeing more realistic doll food videos for your Reborns, definitely let me know in the comments and I will continue the series. Alright guys, well this is all for today. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, remember to give it a like and subscribe to my channel. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you in my next video. Remember, if you have any questions about what you've seen today, let me know in the comments. 